Yahuchanan John 7. After these things, Yahusha walked in Galil, for he would not walk in Yahud, because the Yahudim sought to kill him. Now Yahusha's feast of Kukoth, which the Yahudim observed, was at hand. And his brethren therefore said unto him, Depart hence, and go into Yahud, that your Talmudim also may see the works that you do. But there is no man that does anything in secret, and he himself seeks to be known openly. If you do these things, show yourself to the world, for neither did his brethren believe in him. Then Yahusha said unto them, My time is not yet come, but your time is always ready. The world cannot hate you, but me it hates, because I testify of it, that the works thereof are evil. Go ye up unto this feast. I go not up yet unto this feast, for my time is not yet full come. When he had said these words unto them, he abode still in Galil. But when his brethren were gone up, then went he also up unto the feast, not openly, but, as it were, in secret. Then the Yahudim sought him at the feast, and said, Where is he? And there was much murmuring among the people concerning him. For some said, He is a good man. Others said, Nay, but he deceives the people. Howbeit no man spoke openly of him for fear of the Yahudim. Now about the midst of the feast, Yahusha went up, into the temple and taught. And the Yahudim marveled, saying, How knows this man the scriptures, having never learned? Yahusha answered them and said, My doctrine is not mine, but his that sent me. If any man will do his will, he shall know the doc of the doctrine, whether it be of Yahweh, or whether I speak of myself. He that speaks of himself seeks his own glory, but he that seeks his glory that sent him the same is true, and no unrighteousness is in him. Did not Moshe give you the Torah, and yet none of you keeps the Torah? Why go ye about to kill me? The people answered and said, You have a devil. Who goes about to kill you? Yahusha answered and said unto them, I have done one work, and ye all marvel. Moshe therefore gave unto you circumcision, not because it is of Moshe, but of the fathers. And ye on the Shabbat circumcise a man. If a man on the Shabbat receives circumcision, that the Torah of Moshe should not be broken. Are ye angry at me, because I have made a man every whit whole on the Shabbat? Judge not according to the appearance, but judge righteous judgment. Then said some of them of Yerushalayim, Is not this he whom they seek to kill? But lo, he speaks boldly, and they say nothing unto him. Do the rulers know indeed that this is the very Hamashiach? Howbeit, we know this man whence he is. But when Hamashiach comes, no man knows whence he is. Then cried Yahusha in the temple as he taught, saying, Ye both know me, and ye know whence I am. And I am not come of myself, but he that sent me is true, whom ye know not. But I know him, for I am from him, and he has sent me. Then they sought to take him, but no man laid hands on him, because his hour was not yet come. And many of the people believed on him, and said, When Hamashiach comes, Will he do more miracles than these which this man has done? The Perashim heard that the people murmured such things concerning him, and the Perashim and the chief priests sent officers to take him. Then said Yahusha unto them, Yet a little while am I with you, and then I go unto him that sent me. Ye shall seek me and shall not find me, and where I am thither ye cannot come. Then said the Yahudim among themselves, Whither will he go that we shall not find him? Will he go unto the dispersed among the other nations and teach the other nations? What manner of saying is this that he said, Ye shall seek me, 
and shall not find me. And where I am, thither ye cannot come. In the last days, that great day of the feast, Yahusha stood and cried, saying, If any man thirst, let him come unto me and drink. He that believes on me, as the scripture has said, out of his belly shall flow rivers of living water. But this spoke he of the Ruach, which they that believe on him should receive. For the Ruach HaKadosh was not yet given, because that Yahusha was not yet glorified. Many of the people therefore went, rather when they heard this saying, said, Of a truth, this is the prophet. Others said, This is HaMashiach. But some said, Shall HaMashiach come out of Galil? Has not the scripture said that HaMashiach comes out of the seed of David? and out of the town of Beit Lechem, where David was. So there was a division among the people because of him. And some of them would have taken him, but no man laid hands on him. Then came the officers to the chief priests and Parashim, and they said unto them, Why have ye not brought him? The officers answered, Never man spoke like this man. Then answered them the Parashim, Are ye also deceived? Have any of the rulers or of the Parashim believed on him? But this people who knows not the Torah are cursed. Nichodinam, rather Nichodiman, said unto him, rather them, He that came to Yahusha by night, being one of them, does our Torah judge any man before it hears him? and know what he does. They answered and said unto him, Are you also of Galil? Search and look, for out of Galil arises no prophet. And every man went unto his own house.